Hello, 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 my brilliant learners. Welcome once again to Champions Land Academy, Federal Capital Territory, Abuja. This is story reading time with Mrs. Opayemi. Today, we are going to be reading a story titled, Anansi and Wisdom. Written by Wehan the Jagger. Remember last week we read a similar story titled Anansi and Vulture. But the title of our story today is Anansi and Wisdom. It's a Ghanaian folk tale written by Wehan the Jagger. Let's enjoy reading the story together. Long, long ago, people didn't know anything. They didn't know how to plant crops, or how to weave cloth, or how to make iron tools. The god in Yame, up in the sky, had all the wisdom of the world. He kept it safe in a clay pot. One day, Inyame decided that he would give the pots of wisdom to Anansi. Every time Anansi looked in the clay pot, he learned something new. It was so exciting. Greedy Anansi thought, I'll keep the pot safe at the top of a tall tree. Then I can have it all to myself. He spun a long thread, wound it round the clay pot and tied it to his stomach. He began to climb the tree, but it was hard climbing the tree with the pot bumping him in the knees all the time. All the time Anansi's young son had been standing at the bottom of the tree watching. He said, Wouldn't it be easier to climb if you tied the pot to your back instead? Anansi tried tying the clay pot full of wisdom to his back and it really was a lot easier. In no time, he reached the top of the tree, but then he stopped and thought, I'm supposed to be the one with all the wisdom, and here my son was cleverer than me. Anansi was so angry about this that he threw the clay pot down out of the tree. It smashed into pieces on the ground. The wisdom was free for everyone to share. And that is how people learned to farm, to weave cloth, to make iron tools, and all the other things that people know how to do. What an interesting story. Now listen to the moral of the story. Knowledge shared is knowledge gained. Feel free to share what you know with others and you will be the better for it. Thank you very much for listening to the story. See you again. Bye-bye.